Hey guys, Dan here with Battlefield Curator. And we're gonna look at some 22 caliber trainers. First up here, we got a Mosin trainer. This is Polish. You see the number 11 here, dated 1954. The other rifle we got here is another Polish rifle. It's uh, dated 1933. We're gonna see how well these do at the range. It's 22 caliber, it's fun. That trigger's light. I just touched it and it went off. You got to shoot that. That's such a sweet little trigger. <laughs> it's pretty awesome. For the cartridge. Much lighter trigger than I remember. It is a very light trigger. Whoa! Sucker's light, man. Yeah, I was like, this is not a Mosin trigger by far. <laughs> if you notice, it's a single shot. You only you can only put one shot in there at a time. Watch how nice the action is. All right, so this WZ-31 is an undocumented bring back from the uh, Second World War. So very unique piece, very rare, very collectible. Um, you don't see these come up too often on auction sites or anything. So yeah, it's a, it's a pleasure to shoot this and I wanna thank Will over there, who's uh, behind the camera right now. Uh, yeah, it's pretty cool, pretty cool piece of history. So what we got here is a 22 trainer um, model W48. It's also made in Poland. Uh, factory 11 here, but this one is made in 1954. So after, you know, com block nations were uh, come were coming together. So the Polish were now being trained with uh, Russian style weapons. So this will be interesting. And this one um, was uh, it's, uh, not a bring back from any war, but it is a purchase from uh, importation. About five to ten years ago, these were popular imports, but they did not last for very long. There's a very, very tiny import mark. Oh my gosh, you can barely see it. We're really going to have to get a magnifying glass and check that out, so. Yes, I'm cheating by using the rail. Looks like about 11 o'clock. Yep. Oh. Way down I think I just copied you, Will. Well guys, that's it for the video. We went over some historic uh, 22 training rifles. And uh, you know, these are kind of rare. You just don't see them pop up too often. And they are very collectible. They're fun to shoot because they're 22 and you can get ammo really cheap and you can get a whole bunch of it and just have fun with them at the range. Enjoy that history. 
Um, if you like this kind of content, be sure to share it with your compadres. And uh, as always, be sure to learn history and curate history. Make it a great day.